Hi there, this is Mike. I'm going to talk to you today about location tracking and how we can use it in the ArcGIS platform. Specifically, we'll talk about Tracker for ArcGIS. It's a mobile tracking solution that allows organizations to capture locations of their field staff, monitor where they are, and even analyze where they've been. So I'm using the Tracker app on my iPhone. It also works on Android devices, and I've set it up to track my location. We're able to see tracks that I would have had today, yesterday, as well as over longer periods of time as well. So all of this information that we have is stored in our ArcGIS Enterprise. We can see when I look into the settings that I'm signed in with my ArcGIS identity, and I can set up reminders that will allow me to determine specific times of day when I would like to track my mobile operations. I have other settings available as well that will allow me to determine how the information is collected and different modes that I might want to be working in as well, such as this dark mode which may be preferable under different outdoor conditions. So now that I have all of this information collected, let's see how we can use it in our ArcGIS Enterprise organization. I'm now working in the Track Viewer app that's part of our ArcGIS Enterprise. And we can see here I have the tracks for several members of my team that were displayed. So I have my teams listed on the left here, and I can turn on and off the different members of the team to see the tracks that have been collected. If we go through to the different tools available to us, we can see I'm, I'm displaying information over the last 72 hours, but I have other options available to me as well. Perhaps I'd just like to see when people were driving versus walking. We can turn on those, turn on and off those tools to get more information about our team and what they were doing during that period of time. So with all this information, we can start to create interesting applications and start to understand more information about the data. I'm working in a operations dashboard now that has the information we've collected from Tracker over a larger period of time. With those same team members here, I've got information showing the breakdown of the track points collected by each of the user, a further breakdown of their activity of what they were performing, as well as how many points have been collected, speed, and accuracy. So we really get a sense of the information that we're collecting here when we take a look at the data and we can see the different points, each of the different track points that have been collected and we can see here all of the information that's collected about the device and about what we're doing as we're moving with the device and our points are collected with our GIS Enterprise. So at this point we've just been visualizing the data but we can do so much more with it. With some of that same data that we've got collected here, I can perform analysis on it using the analysis tools that are available to us, specifically with the GeoAnalytics server and ArcGIS Enterprise. I may want to aggregate the points to create bins of data to get a better understanding of information with a series of collected points all in one location. In this case, I can look at speed. I may also want to look at finding locations and detecting specific incidents. So I may want to look at specific information that could be happening in this data. Perhaps have I traveled over a certain speed to know if my crew and my team is operating safely. So let's take a look at the results of when we do that analysis. Here's the track hexagons from the mean speeds that we have. And we can see here the darker the color means the higher the speed. So in this instance, we can see traveling pretty much at the speed limit in the dark blue but as we move through downtown Toronto, this member of the team would have perhaps come across construction, a traffic accident, and had to slow down in this situation. We can also look at how the results of that detect incidents occurred, or the results from there. The information that we'll have from these points are any time that our field worker was traveling over 100 kilometers per hour. So we can get any information that we'd like to see, in this case, what speeds they were traveling, and know if this was a safe operation for them to be working in or not. So that's a look at Tracker for ArcGIS and how we can use location tracking across the ArcGIS platform.